Hello there folks, it is TIJ Gaming and welcome to a new video and today it is time for something very very different and this just might be a one off video or might be something a little bit more regular. This is Snowtopia, the ski resort tycoon and today I'm going to be playing my first 20 minutes of the game, see how I find it and uh, this will probably be a first impressions video. Now I'd like to thank the guys over at Goblins Publishing who have offered me a code to play this for free in early access. I'm a member of a great site called Keymailer, whereby developers send you a key or propose to send you keys for, for games to review or play on your channel that might be suited to yourself. And there are some games on there that I think, no, they definitely don't suit. But this one, Tycoon Ski Resort, it's a little bit different um, and it's something that I'm looking forward to getting into today. So it might be a one-off video, depending on how I enjoy it. It might well become a little bit of a mini-series, perhaps a five or ten episode series. But I'm just going to go into this completely open-minded to see what it is. So, I suppose you're asking, like me, what on earth is Snowtopia? We know it's a ski resort tycoon, but not a lot more apart from that. So, let's have a look at the Steam page. So, the tagline is, build your ideal ski resort. Ski Keep skiers smiling with fresh pistes and fine facilities. Ski, build and chill in the wintry world of Snowtopia, where everyone is welcome. Which sounds pretty good. Uh, if we go down a little bit on the page, um, we know all that. Place peace on the mountainside in just a few clicks. 11 types of ski lift give you plenty of choice. Welcome skiers of every kind. Sit back and chill on the mountain. Yeah, it, it sounds like an interesting game. As I said, we'll give it a try. It doesn't seem like it's going to be too demanded on the PC, which is nice. Uh, minimum requirements is 4 gigabytes of RAM, so we should have no problem on that regard. But let's get into a new game, shall we? I've checked all the settings. That's about all I've done. So let's go into a new game. So... There are seven different places we can go to to start, but I think it's best we start with the simplest one. So let's go with Mount Alpha, a difficulty score of one, free access points, difficulty criteria, access to ski zones, these are all one out of three. As I understand, there is a tutorial on this, so hopefully there will be, or else I'll be absolutely stumped. Ah, here we go. Hi, what are you doing out here in the middle of nowhere? Are you lost? There's nothing but snow around here. What am I doing here? I like starting the day with a nice bracing walk in the icy air. To be fair, I agree with that. Especially over lockdown, I've been getting up at stupid hours and, and going for a walk. So, you know, I agree, whoever you are. So you want to build the ski resort of your dreams. In that case, you've come to the right place. To start with, take a trip around the mountain and study its relief. You can also always hover your cursor over the entries in this list. To get more information or open the game help indicated by a question mark. Okay. So we've ro rotate the camera, we've zoomed the camera. We've got the arrow keys, cool. How do we open the game's help again? I forgot that one. Click the icon at the bottom. Okay, cool. So now loads of different help bits, which is a big plus. A big plus when it comes to game like this. Uh, now that I want to set to work are the materials and logistics. Once you have a functional builder's lodge, you can construct the rest of your ski area. Place the building beside the zone you want to make your ski area. So, open the construction menu, which I guess is not that one. Where's the construction menu? Ah, okay, construction menu is a click one of the four buttons and access what you have available. Okay. Like I say, a lot of this is very much just going to be me learning the game, so... You're learning all along with me. Um, Builder's Lodge, isn't it? Okay. So we want it connects to a slope or a navigation zone. Which can go here then in that case. Ah, okay. Building closed. Assign volunteers. There you go. Everything is set. Cool. Let's get two volunteers on that. Holy snowflakes, a ski resort in my own backyard. Can I help you out? Please say I can. Where do I start? A ski tow and slope are all I need to keep me happy. Okay, let's build a ski lift then. So, on the construction menu, click on the ski lifts tab. Which I'm guessing is this one. Build a slope. Uh, sorry, build a ski lift first. So, I guess we want a two-person one. It's probably more money, but oh well. So where? The gradient is too steep. Yeah, let's just chuck it up there, shall we? Okay. Let's just circle it around and see how we go. See how we get to. Because it, 
if you can build it there, then surely um, there's a potential. This scale lift is blocked by this or this or this. So I'm guessing that. Let's just right click first and go somewhere a little bit better so we're not blocked by much, which the problem is I think we are. Okay, let me figure this one out for myself. Um, while other than stumbling over my words, I'll be back in a second. Okay, so we've got a ski lift. We've managed out where to build on. It's not the most fancy in the world, but it does take you up to there. Just a tutorial level, really, at the moment. But this game does it does work well. Um, it, it certainly looks good graphically. Again, these games don't have to look fantastic at the end of the day, um, as long as they do what they say on the tin. Just um, speed up the construction of that. And we're nearly there. But as I said, a lot of this will be me umming and ahhing, having not a clue what to do. But I think that's the beauty of it sometimes. So, not connected. No volunteers. We need a volunteer. That will help. Obviously, we need a slope. Open the construction menu. Click on the slope tab, which is this one. And let's go for a comfortable width. So, I guess we need to go on the help button, don't we? Drawing slopes. To build a slope, select its side, then draw it from top to bottom. Click once to step the start and use intermediary clicks to define the slope slant. Double click to confirm the slope. This is too technical for me. My dad's a builder, that you know, I could do with him here. Um, normal, so. Okay. Impossible to build uphill slope. Well, that's understandable. So we can either go. I guess it's probably not best not to start there, actually. Um, but maybe start there. Make it really basic and just come straight down. I guess that'll do. Oh. No, I only want something basic to start off with. I think that's done it, has it? No. Let's go back into help. Drawing slopes. Double click to confirm the slope. Okay. When a slope is built, difficulty level is automatically calculated. There we go. Perfect. Excellent. I think it's good for games like this just to carry on rather than go, oh, I'll sit here for half an hour and not be quite sure what I want to do. Um, because for new players, it, it, it is crucial to have a level like this, a tutorial level. I mean, it's, you know, there's a fair amount of detail if you look. The graphic isn't too bad at all. Better speed this up so the ski slope gets built. And then after this, we can uh, greet our first ski. As you can see, the ski slope is in... Is in action. Site construction is nearly there. Okay. Not connected. Again, not sure. So, greet your first skiers. Make sure the slope and ski lifts are connected to the access point. Without this, skiers will not come. That's not connected. I want to know how we do connect it. So that's connected to the access point, correct? That's not connected. Okay. Very difficult slope. Excellent. Well, that's what we aimed for. Um, I mean, look at that. I, I, I wouldn't want to go down there. I'm just trying to figure out, and I will probably break off again here to figure out how we connect this. Okay then, folks, I'm back. Um, <laughs> I've been sat here for about 20 minutes, moaning and groaning, uh, with a few expletives in there, admittedly, because I had absolutely no idea what I was doing. But luckily, through trial and error, I've made it. The reason that, well, the one reason why the first one didn't work, right, was that I tried to build a lift over here. Hopefully you can see my mouth. So it's sort of up to this tree. But the bloody slope didn't start till up here. So... Somehow in my mind it wasn't clicking that they weren't able to get up here. So, yeah, that that was a classic moment for the ages, that was. And now I can't figure out how we get back. 
Where's the bot? Ah, it's over here. Let's go over here. Um, but you can tell that I don't go out of my comfort zone very much with games. Uh, you really can, because I had absolutely no idea what I was doing there. I've lost the slope again, you know. Where's the, where's the slope gone now? I had a funny functioning snope, a slope, and I don't know where it's gone. Where's the slope gone? Oh, dear Lord. There we go. There's the slope. Right. Um, so we have to get it to an access point. Uh, the slope to an access point. And then obviously at the top of the lift, have the slope there. So we finally built our slope. Oh, that was a bit of fun. Goodness me. But, um, no, I, I, I don't step out of my comfort zone very much. And as I said, I think you can probably tell. So, we've got our first skiers at the resort. I don't believe it. Your first skiers have come. Look at them lined up for the ski lift. They make their way up, then whoosh. Some of them are really bad. Even I can ski better than that. Right, let's have a good laugh. Go on, save at the moment. Okay. So, aim the camera at the skier. Wherever the skier is. I guess we go to the top of the, the slope. Or the lift. This game is pretty good graphically, you know. I have to say, it, it's not bad at all. So, we need someone to be at the top of the lift, preferably. They're all just skating round here, look. Why are they all skating round here? Aim the camera at the skier. Which is what I'm doing now. Okay, so he's going up there. Ah, there's loads going up now, look. Oh, and that. Whoa, 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 hang on, hang on. How do we aim the camera at the skier? Use the target icon at the top left of the... Ah, there we go. No. Use the target icon at the top left... There we go. Got it. Got it. Display history. Okay. So we can follow our ski around now. Which is nice. And see how this one gets on. Ski waiting for assistance. Someone's died probably on the, on the slope. We'll worry about that later. But this, I think it's very much getting into this. But I genuinely do think this could be a good a good uh, one to play. So they're coming down the slope. And we've missed them. Bloody awesome. Okay, who's waiting for assistance? Oh, dear. Uh, um, oh, dear. That's 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 worrying. But we'll, we'll, we'll leave that till we get there in the tutorial. To gr create a green slope, build it in a gradual gradient or factor in bends. Okay. We obviously need to connect it. So we want a green slope. As you can see, the colours here. We just want something that's nice and tame. Move the camera down. I think this will end up maybe being a blue slope. I'm not sure. It's certainly green up to the end, isn't it? So that's been built now. We'll find out what it is once it's built. I need to make sure I'm still recording, by the way. And I didn't stop in that um, time of whinging about the game. But they're all flocking up now, if you look. Ski lift waiting for mechanic. Awesome. Oh, dear. Look at them all waiting in line. Um, we need a mechanic, then, in that case. Mechanics workshop. Plop that there. Get that built. But let's worry about the ski slope first. Then we can get the mechanic in. Look at this. They're all, they're all getting wound up. We should have waited. We should have closed this before we... Uh... Right, okay. We built a green slope. Okay, so that's good. Let's get this built, then. I think this first episode will probably be good. Um, a good time to end when we've gone through the tutorial. So this is stage number four. Then we'll see how we go. I, I'm guessing it's working now. Because, uh, well, they're all on it, you can see. But we're building a mechanics workshop, which is what I guess we need to do. Someone's fell at the bottom again. I suppose the one thing is it uh, that there's 
45 skiers here, and it's not going to be quick enough. So no volunteer assigned. Got one of them now. Movement in progress. And that volunteer should be open to repair these things, you would have thought. Maintenance in progress. Right, perfect. So we now need to build a blue slope. Build on an average gradient. Suits into medium level skiers. Okay. Can we get away with another slope on here? I think we can, he says. Well, that's that slope. Can't build an uphill though. That's the problem, I guess. We're going to struggle to... Okay. Um, <coughs> that, that's, that's not going to be the best slope in the world. Right, let's have a look at this. So that's... That slope there, if you look. Okay, let's let's try our best to keep this a blue slope, eh? Rather than a red one. But it's a bit tricky to to do when you're working on this angle. So that's a blue. So we want want it to be a bit more difficult than that. That's a green still. Is it still a green? If it is a green, we can just close it. I've got no problem with that. This slope is blocked by that. Okay. Is that a, bl a green slope? I mean, that's the most terrible thing that I've ever done. There's three skiers waiting for assistance. I think they're working their way around. But I think that's probably a green slope again. We're probably going to have to build another a ski lift because we haven't got much room. I think we just probably keep it to the two slopes there. Unless this is indeed a blue slope, which it isn't, unfortunately. It's a green slope, so we'll get rid of that. We'll build a new new ski lift. Try and not get completely brassed off by the fact it's not collected or connected. So let's have one here. Probably go a bit higher. That's probably going to help us a bit more. Okay. So that's the slope. Let's get that built. And we'll pause this a second so we can build our slopes. We want a want a large one here. So that's connected to that. I guess we go narrow then in that case. So if it's blue, what, what does it need to be? Is the question. Here we go. That's going more blue now if you look. Even red dare I say it. That's going blue, which is good. So that's green. We don't want it green, we want it blue. No way we can really change that. Though. Let's see. Let's see if that does um, become a blue slope. But this is just all about learning. It's all about learning. This is on the job. And sometimes, as I say, it's, it's, it's definitely fun watching. Well... Yeah, debatable, I know. But sometimes it is definitely fun watching um, people learn on the job and when we're playing the game. But this is something I'm definitely intrigued by. As long as we can get through the this tough point. It's not a green slope. That's annoying. But uh, Actually, no, we don't know, do we? Because the ski lift's just been built. So, we are going to divert traffic between two ski lifts. You can see the traffic is being diverted slightly. But we've got 62 skiers now. So, as I say, we can we can effectively rip all this up once we've done the tutorial level. And there we go. Right, good. Don't get too carried away. The first victory could also be your last. The toughest challenge is still to come. Okay. So, that's part number seven done. Believe in old ski dogs. Skiers must get plenty of rest. Okay, so... Build a kiosk. And then assign a volunteer. I'm hoping that some of the bits we've done are the hardest we've done. Because I might just cry if it gets any harder than this. Okay. Assign a volunteer. Boom. Done. So that's that one done. That was nice and quick. Build a ski patrol lodge. Build a mechanics workshop. We've got the mechanics workshop I think. 
Yeah, we've done that. Build a ski patrol lodge. Build a snow groomer hangar. And then we'll just wait for those to be built. So I'll be back in just a second. Okay, so that's done. I made a list of all the accidents that can happen. We snow groomers, patrollers and mechanics. The jumper drops. That's 60... Oh, there we go. Very fantastic. Great. It's good, but I think we should be a little bit more ambitious. Righto. Let's build a research laboratory. Feels like we're very much blocking all the places that our ski lifts could be here. Um, so that might not be the best idea. Not connected to it. Ah, so it has to be connected. So, yeah, we were, we were right doing it there. I'd like to have them all on the side, like that. So they're all nice and neat. This does remind me of a Taiku game I used to play. Not a skiing game, but a game called The Movies. Uh, it was made by Lionhead Studios in the early 2000s. And that was awesome. It wasn't like this. It wasn't a skiing game, but it was a, as you could probably guess, a movie studio game. I think I might like to cover that on the channel at some point. But this is just, as I said, something different. If this is your first video of mine and you're still here, I'll, I'm amazed. Um, I, I, I do make Football Manager content and Snooker 19 content. So very much into my sport. But I do like these sort of tycoons as well. I played a lot of, as I say, the movies. Played a hell of a lot of um, Frillville when I was a kid as well. Loved that game. And uh, there's a few others I can't really remember, but... You know, I've played Two Point Hospital last year, enjoyed that. I, I do enjoy these sorts of games. But we're nearly there with the research lab. I think this is step seven of nine. So we're a few percent away from getting there. And that's that done. So we need to get a volunteer in. Initiate a project. So how do we go about that? Open the research bar using the bar at the top of the screen and initiate a project. Which we've done. And then obtain upgrade. Volunteers assigned to the laboratory will research the upgrade automatically. So I guess we wait for that to happen. As you can see, that's up there. And uh, just so I don't want to make this too long, that's all. Um, so I'll see you guys in a second. So that's another milestone. Who knows? Soon they'll invent a ski lift like a ski toe. You should appoint me as your official name inventor. Whatever you like. Whatever you like. Okay, your resort's kind of cute, but I would have a few suggestions to make. Just a few blue slopes and some comfortable ski lifts. Okay. Open the skier screen. The number of skiers is up here. Select a profile, which we've done. Okay. And then welcome 150 skiers. Meet your skiers' needs to increase their satisfaction and bring more to the resort. Okay, so... Um, Snowstruck lovers. We probably want some more aggressive slopes, I would say. Where's the problem, Q? Yeah, I guess we chuck two volunteers on each of these. How many volunteers have we got? We've got ten. So there's... Well, there's... 27 actually, so there's plenty of unassigned volunteers, so we can chuck a few more on these if we need to. What's the problem with this now? Oh, it's not connected? Ah, that's the problem. So let's get rid of that. And I guess we can probably destroy this and build it somewhere better. So that's, maintenance is in progress, which is fine. So we want to build a bigger sleek ski lift. So say maybe that's that was my problem earlier. You see, we've we've completely chucked out any chance of having any space. So let's I guess build it in a similar position, not too close. I guess sort of there. I mean, this is going to be exactly where we were before, arguably, but it doesn't really matter. Okay, so we're going up to there. Then we want something that's really really tough. Which, believe me, I can do. Or maybe we can't. Let's see what makes this red. So, a real steep gradient, I guess. But it, I suppose it's tough when you've not got much space to play with. So, more bends is green. There's a bit of red. There's a bit of red in there because it's a it's a steep slope if you look, and it goes blue when you introduce a bend. Okay, 
Okay. So again, that's that's more blue. Let's build this. Let's see um, how it goes. Problem waiting for builder. Well, we'll get there. But I think, you know, guys, I think we'll leave it there for today's video. Um, we are certainly getting there with things, but I think I probably need a maybe 10, 15 minutes off camera or even in a part two uh, to understand what's really going on here. But um, I don't know how this is going to come across. There's been a lot of cuts and me going, um, I don't know what the hell I'm doing here, but I guess that's half the charm. But this is something that if you guys enjoy, I'm certainly worth doing um, a mini series on this, whether it be a few parts or... Or even more. We'll certainly see how we get on. Um, but yeah. If you uh, did enjoy today's video. Please leave a like down below. Comment your thoughts as well. And even subscribe if you'd like to see some more of this. I'll make a decision later on. Whether I do release more of this. Because the game does come out on Tuesday. Um, not sure how you guys can particularly get it yourselves. Um, we'll learn about that as we go. As you can see we've got some more skis. Which is excellent to see. Maybe with another slope I think we might do it now. Um, but yeah, I hope you've all enjoyed today's video. I have been TIJ Gaming, and I will see you guys in the next one.